Adar Youssef has won the crown at the 2021 Miss University Africa beauty pageant. Her prize includes $50,000, a new car, and being named a United Nations student ambassador. The Somali student received much support online from her community. The event was held at the Cheetah International Hotel Jabi in Abuja, Nigeria. 61 women between the ages of 18 and 26 competed for the title. The rules require they not be married nor have any children. All I can say is that she is golden. Her smile is golden, and I'm not even talking about the dress. Her smile is golden. Her eyes. I suddenly feel a cold shiver creeping up my spine. But I'm a professional. I have to control it. This is the beauty from Lesotho. The beauty contest was one element of the ninth Let's annual Malawi. African Personality Forum. To Malawi. The African Union is among the sponsors of the event. Allow me also to thank the president of the African Personality Forum and Miss University Africa for the invitation extended to the African Union Commission to participate in this important initiative that brings together young women from throughout the continent and assists them in becoming better versions of themselves through the promotion of African identity, shared values, and women empowerment to serve better their nation, region, and the continent at large. Each woman is asked a question to give her a chance to show off her poise and intelligence. Do you think African women should be given equal opportunities to lead like men and why? Do you think African women should be given equal opportunities to lead like the men and why? I think African women should be given equal rights as men and should be given the opportunities to lead like um, live equally as men because we all have equal we all have um, values to, we all have values to give to the society we all have different um <laughs> finally we have miss university somalia Your question is, is the social media harmful or helpful to African youths and why? Is the social media harmful or helpful to African youths and why? I would say it really depends on the person who's using it. If you're some, some people use it for their business purposes, some people use it to um, promote what their talent is so i would say it would really depend on the person who's really using the social media sometimes it could be yes it could affect some uh, on the other side and on the other side it could be preventing and it could be a source of income for some people thank you adar use this opportunity to shine ADN TV will continue to report on outstanding achievements by Somalis across the globe.